this is the energy vibration laser for um, the Libra and Sun Moon and Rising sign. It is the um, first week. Knight of Swords. Knight of Swords. Mention the people between the ages. The Knight of Swords. Okay. All right. There's information. Some of you could be spied on. Some of you could be the spy. Some of you um, could be watched through your computer because that does happen, people. Once you have a camera and you use a camera, people can be watching you um, via your computer. So be aware of that. In the suite, the Knight of Swords just fall, fell out. Knight of Swords is always the energy of intellectual, but communication, but also espionage and people um, um, watching you, okay? So let's look and see what's coming up for the lab brands. This week is the first week of the year 2019. Please remember to like, share, thumbs up, and support. Thank you for returning to another year. Readings um, or it been done differently this year. So it's the same energy, but they're friends, and it's not the same energy as a new year. So you liberates, let's see what's happening. Hurt energy is all over. Um, energy vibration of this week is bringing balance in your life. Bring in balance in your life. Now the Knight of Swords is here. It's going to be the central, so it's going to be um, whatever the, end, uh, the the situation is. Um, um, you people between the ages, and this week is going to affect the people between the ages of 18 and 45. Please like, share these videos, share, share these videos, thumbs up, listen, cross watch to find out who is affecting you and what is happening around you. Okay, you liberals, let's see what's coming up. You have the five of pentacles, you have the eight of pentacles, so um, this has to do with work, there's a celebration that is coming up. You have the Four of Pentacles trying to build your financial stability. The Four, um, this is um, really positive. Three of Wands, you're leaving. Some of you are deciding to leave your work. Ace of Cups, new love is coming in for you. okay so we're, we're doing the reading in another um the energy of the eye princess is here watching over your week listen to your intuition your spirit guides are watching over you 44 33 44 33 44 is the engine the, the um, energy of the angels 33 is the energy of the ascendance masters this is a year that you're going to start seeing your spirit guides be awakened for this because these things are going to be happening i can see them coming out all already in the in um this first week is going to affect most of the people between the ages of 18 and 45 okay what should the liberals look out for mostly in this week okay okay Ooh, you liberals okay so what you should look forward to mostly in this week is the two of Pentacles in reverse some of you have made a decision because you have seen the truth of the situation and you have some regrets okay so again some of you have seen the truth of the situation and you've seen some regrets okay now let's look at this and um, let's um, read as we go along some of you could have had um, a disturbing situation with your work where you were expecting to receive a bonus you didn't receive this bonus and um, you are going to be deciding to leave for, because it's not it's not working out you know that sort of a thing um, I'm seeing some celebration some of you are receiving eye position um, I'm seeing that some of you are going to be receiving news about your um, that your financial stability some offer of work is going to be coming in I am seeing some of you really turning your back on your work I'm seeing you some of you have some regrets 
there's a lot of regrets over your work a lot of regrets over your work or over position it's all about work in this week work about making decision about your work and that is coming up on um, the first of January you're deciding mm, am I going to stay in this job um, you know do I really like this job do I want to be with this people that sort of a thing is coming up okay um, some of you are seeing the truth about especially you young people between the age of 18 and 45 you're seeing the truth about a situation about your financial stability and you're seeing it's as if you're receiving the message of how to move forward and that is going to be good let's see what else is um, coming out here two of swords you're seeing the some of you are seeing the truth about a financial your financial stability okay um All right, a lot of information is here Knights of Cups now the King of Swords and the Knight of Cups the Knight of Swords and the King of Cups the Knight of Swords and the King of Cups so um, some of you liberals are dealing with these two people in this week some of you are seeing the truth about the King of Cups okay whoever this King of Cups is whether it's your partner and you're gonna end a relationship with him it could be your boss or your partner but you're going to be ending the relationship with this knight of cups whoever he is so people between the ages of 18 and 45 you are seeing there is a situation between you and someone who is a Pisces cancer or a scorpion 45 years and older or over the ages of 40 but you're seeing a situation about this finally you're seeing the truth about a situation you're going to be ending um, this some of you this knight of cups could be someone in the in power who have done something wrong and um his reign is coming down his reign is coming down okay so there is a situation um that you're not seeing about your financial stability or about something in your life some hardship that you're going through okay and it is time to make a decision all right it is time to make a decision at work some of you the four of cups is here some of you are going to be receiving an offer for a new job it's not what you want but take it anyway okay it's that's the best thing you can always take it and then find something else now you're gonna be celebrating over the king of ones whoever this king of ones is you're going to be celebrating not with him but against him and I gotta ask this message about this king of wands okay because the energy of celebration comes up then the king of wands comes up what is the message about this king of wands what is the message about this king of wands you this king of wands could be your father um, some of you your father could be an Aries Lee or Sagittarius um and you're going to be celebrating with your father okay king of ones um could be the king of ones could be a father uh, a connection with you it could be your father and you're going to be celebrating with your father okay whatever the situation is this person is connected to you whether it's in this lifetime or a past lifetime okay uh but uh, celebration so it could be that some of you are reconnecting and celebration maybe going away on a trip with the king of ones okay the king of ones is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius now um, money is going to be coming to you some of you are going to be receiving some financial help or financial stone now some of you that had a situation that your boss was um, a Pisces cancer or a scorpion this organization his company his reign is coming to an end there is an end there is the lies and the deceitfulness whoever this king of cups is um, if it's someone in power or it was your ex boss or whatever the, his reign has come to an end the energy of the tower came or it could be a company that you have been working with and this man um, 
as deceivingly done something is rain is coming to an end again a lot of people and I've been saying the seven of cups some of you are leaving this person behind and there are new opportunities that is going to be coming towards you so this could be your husband who is also the king of cups is a Pisces cancer or a scorpion and you're leaving this person behind the three of ones and there are new opportunities that is coming for you so some of you could be ending a relationship with the king of cups you're leaving him behind and someone new is about to come in your spirit guides is going to be bringing this person in your life okay so um, this is very good because Saturday and Sunday it's good Saturday is as if you decide to um, end something in your life and Sunday someone new just popped up maybe text you or you you went someplace and you cross part with this person you realize you know it is really time some of you could be reconnecting with this King of Cups Or you know, but you're saying no. You're saying no because you're you're reconnect. It's as if this King of Cups is a past lover or someone who, but um, uh, you have some regrets about this King of Cups. Whoever this King of Cups is, a Pisces, Cancer, a Scorpion, you have some regrets about this person. And some of you between the ages of 18 and 45, this could be your father, this could be your partner. But whatever the situation is, you saw the truth about this King of Cups. You have some regrets, okay? You're making some decisions, and the decisions that you're about to make, especially work, is on you. A lot of you work is on your mind. Okay, a lot of you work is on your mind. Okay, some of you are going to be finding out that someone who is an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius is your father, and you're going to be reconnecting with your father. That message came out for someone out there. Okay, all right, so let's see what's happening. We're using the wisdom of the Havilon. This is card one for the Librans, card two for the Librans. Let's see what's happening. Okay, so this is card one and this is card two. Choose a card. The card with the ring on my hand is one and the card with no ring on my hand is two. So if you choose card one, the lady of the lake, absolute truth, courage, self-respect, and responsibility. So if you choose card one, um, you're going to take on the the energy of the lady of the lake and it's about responsibility it's about self-respect it's about you know you taking charge of your life and you taking charge of your life in a positive way there we go number eight energies your numbers for this um, week is number 33 and number eight number 33 and number eight is very good infinity abundancy okay card two the raven card two is the raven and we have if you choose the raven expect magic expect um, coincidence expect synchronicity and expect events to happen in your life this week so this is going to be good I love you guys so much please enjoy your first week of 2019 and I am saying thank you for being here namaste I will speak to you guys next time